Hello, welcome to the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> you can't. I'm joking. I'm jo- I'm jo- <laughs> Hello, welcome to the Milk Bar Podcast, the podcast where we cover comedic commentary, pop culture from the week prior, including recent news, games, food, and more. Today, I'm joined with not everyone, but most of them. The good ones. The good ones. The ones that count, isn't it, really. <laughs> and you're back. You haven't been here for like know, I've been, seven been months. So long. Yeah. Where have Don't you been? Again. Uh, I just dip in and out. <laughs> <laughs> Dip your toes in. What does that mean? <laughs> I don't know. Get on with the intro. Right, I've done that bit. There you go. No, you're doing the whole thing, the mate. The whole thing? Yeah, yeah. Oh, my. I haven't signed up for this. You're the host with the most. <sighs> sign up for that. joke. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the most yeah. weight. Right, Patreon. <laughs> We've got one. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Calm down, Oshan. We've, we've talked about this. Just three pounds. Three pounds, price of a small coffee. <laughs> and you get a great deal. Merch discounts, podcast specials, and you get to help us produce the videos that we uh, put out on the channel. Just three pound a month, please check it out. Is it really worth three pound? Uh, sorry, carry on. That's not... Th- it is. Okay. Subscribe. All right. Story of the week. We know the drill. Everyone, let's, let's just tell each other a story. Well, I feel like you haven't been here in a while, so you should go first. No. <laughs> You've got one ready. I don't. <laughs> it's not even that good, to be honest. Yeah, but but, but we all want to hear it. I've essentially I I had my carpets fitted today mm. in my. I have a house, by the way. I've, I don't know if I told everyone. All right, but I have a house. Stop going on about it. And that's it. I've had my car- <laughs> no. I've had my carpets fitted. Anyway, so it's been a while because, long story short, I was living in a bit of a shithole for a while because it was decorating whatever. Finally finished the upstairs, so carpets are down. And whilst they were doing it, I was just working, whatever, and scrolling on my phone or whatever. And then I started hearing something a bit weird in the background. So I was like, what the fuck is that? Like when they were working. So I, I, I was like, pause the TV and whatever so I could hear. Listened in. And then I just heard, <laughs> like for, for a solid 10 to 20 minutes, right? Guy was just being sick in my toilet. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, what? What? And and he didn't even say anything about it after. So he was like, yeah, we're all done now, mate. And I was like, <laughs> with what? The being sick? Or like, are you done? Yeah, and, at least um, clean it up properly. Well, I, to be honest, I didn't even check. That's horrible. But then Stephen was like, what if... Well, it's a, it's a good job that he did it in the bathroom, at least. And I was Imagine like, yeah, hang on. It. Hang on a minute. What if he's put it under... <laughs> what if that's the under there? <laughs> well, that was a bit squidgy bit. Fucking going yeah. up the stairs, like... So yeah, that was that was my day. What if he wasn't just in the bathroom? What if he's just <laughs> <laughs> up the walls? <laughs> one of the bedrooms. <laughs> you'll, you'll open one of the wardrobes and there's just a puddle of sick. <laughs> in the it was it was just fucking. I was like, what is happening? Like, and then he did. It was just weird that like, fair enough. If you don't feel well, or he's got something going on and he's just sick, like fair. But it's the fact that he did that, <laughs> threw up for like twenty minutes, knowing I could hear him throwing up, and then just didn't say anything about it. It was like. You, you would just say, that, oh, so, I just really don't feel well, You'd at sorry. at least mention it, yeah. yeah but he was but like, yep, yeah, we're all done now, mate, here's your invoice. And I was like, okay. <laughs> Taking a tenner off for the sick. <laughs> <laughs> Have you added a tenner for the sick? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's all new service. <laughs> yeah. But the carpet's nice. Good. So yeah, You haven't got are, that yeah. cheese down anymore. No. <laughs> yeah, really funny <laughs> fucking joke. <laughs> Under, the underlay that I previously had was yellow for reference, so I kept sending photos like, "Oh yeah, look what I've done! Oh nice fucking cheesy carpet." <laughs> it's like, right? I was, I was I literally the first thing I said. Yeah. Always made me hungry. <laughs> so yeah, had new carpets and the guy was sick all over them. That's my story. That was an eventful day. Now I'll have to sign the story about how he killed someone. <laughs> <laughs> he killed someone intentionally. Um, <laughs> no, my story's gonna be pretty boring this week. It's just gonna be. I've got a new job. I quit my last job because I couldn't take it. And it was killing me. Uh, so I got a nice, nicer job. And today was my first day. How'd it go? I'm knackered. I was up at half five in the morning to get a bus. It was, I'm just tired, okay? What time does the job start? Well, I'm supposed to be there at six, but it's just no way I'm going to make that. So Jesus. I got in for half six and then... Did you stay half an hour later? Not half an hour later, no. Three hours later. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I got out, I got out at one o'clock and then and then I was just at home doing some housework and then now I'm here. 
Did they tell? Did you tell them that you were going to be like there at half an hour later? Yeah, they knew. They, they, and they were fine, they were fine with, with it. it yeah. Okay. So from the go, going forward, are you like? Yeah. But I've got no choice in either way. Like I'm not going to walk in fucking three in the morning. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like you get there when you get there. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. They're fine with it though. But yeah, the, peop- the people seem nice. Yeah, they're all lovely. Like there was a couple of guys I was put with today. Um, we were just having a laugh, like laughing and joking as we were putting stuff out. And then one of the lads there I've known for years. I used to be his boss, and now he's my boss. It was pretty cool. He's buzzing about it. He can't wait to order me about. <laughs> <laughs> it's like payback. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, that's my story. Pretty boring, but. Well, congrats. Thank you. Well, you've been in the same line of work for how many years now? Though? Many years, and it's fifty. <laughs> Just awful. <laughs> Sixteen years. I was, it was, I think, seven years. I was a chef. Really? Yeah. And then so. Yeah, since I was 20. And then when I was 21... Wait, you're 20... Hang on. You're 27? Yeah. Damn. Holy shit. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Damn. Mate, I didn't realise that. Sorry, I just always... I don't know. It's all right. Most people think I'm in my 30s, so... Um. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's just mad. You're well old. What? Sorry. Ellis, you got a story for us? Nothing pops to mind. I'm having the the moment of a thousand yard stare because I'm recovering from a sixty hour week work thing. Sixty hour week work. <laughs> <laughs> my, my mind's mush. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing but mushy peas in there, mate. He loves peas as well. I fucking <laughs> love he peas. peas. <laughs> and you were working at the uh theatre? I was, yeah. Yeah. Was it alright or just tiring? No, it was all right. Just a lot of shit happening in the same week. Um, it was for an opera, and usually they're like seasonal. Oh, Chris loves the opera. Go on, do your impression of the opera. <laughs> Were you just going to do shit? shit them <laughs> I was going to go for it, but then I was like, no, go on, go on. No, right. <laughs> continue. Alex. I was very Sorry, Chris, being shit out. Um, so the opera is usually seasonal. So there's like one every, you know, winter, etc. And they decided to put two in one week. So there was a lot of turnaround for it. So just... Idiots. Like, <laughs> 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 it's interesting, but I'm, I'm done. That's like proper opera, like, ooh, mm. like that kind of... Yeah, you, were saying, you were saying to me before you got out like one night at like 5 a.m. I did, yeah. What? What mm. time did you start? Uh, For that was half ten in the morning. Jesus. Hang on, what? Mm. So hang on, you start at half ten in the morning. I think and so. And you left the next day at five a.m. Mm. What were you doing? Just, just having just a kip. <laughs> <laughs> Massive nap, that power nap. On the middle of the stage. <laughs> he was in the opera. Damn. I was in the opera. I actually was. <laughs> oh, nice. There was um. He's the Phantom. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> they did a version for students, I think, and it was like a lot less. Uh, don't know what you call it. Like the production value of it was far lesser. They were it required less work, <coughs> and usually, like when they change scenes, they put a curtain up and then you kind of run over and do your shit. But for this one, they didn't. So we just rocked up on stage, no curtain. They just watched us do our thing. I really? stared at some students and <laughs> swore at them. Yeah, nice. nice. That's horrible. It's not nice. Sorry, yeah, no, it's <laughs> awful, awful, yeah, it's awful. awful time. I don't <laughs> care at that point. <laughs> well, at least you're chirpy about it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Chris? Um, I'm trying to think of a story, but I've got, it's not my story. Oh, fuck me, you can't keep doing this. <laughs> I know, <laughs> he never tells his own stories. He's just telling, hi- he's just fucking history lessons here, isn't it? It's like, <laughs> right, so, in the 19th century, <laughs> fuck off, tell it's your own story. So, funny. so there was this I'm artist in it, Austria. Mate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> This one's a classic, yeah. <laughs> Cut to five years later. <laughs> um, all right, then, what's higher? Right. Tell us a story about yourself. <laughs> well, I haven't been doing anything interesting, so... <sighs> I feel like I've, I've said, you know, I've said everything about me. I'm not, nothing else is going on. <laughs> <laughs> nothing <laughs> nothing else has ever nothing. happened 18 <laughs> episodes yeah. into a podcast and everyone knows everything about you. <laughs> yeah, basically, yeah, to be fair. You're very one-dimensional. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell! Really is really rough, isn't he? <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Um, Shut up. Yeah. Uh, Go on, fucking tell, tell you. Tell the story, yeah. oh, if you have to. I don't... It, okay. Whose story is it? It's someone from work. Obviously, because you've got no other fucking friends. Oh, is this friends. the dog one? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I've already, I've already told that. Oh, uh, yeah, that. yeah. No, actually... This is a good story. Oh, um, okay. Now he wants to hear it. You should have led with that. <laughs> <laughs> it's about dogs. Now I'm into it. Mm. Go on. So no, actually, because now you're gonna win. No, oh. no, I think. No, uh, you, you would with your fucking carpet. <laughs> <laughs> well, no. But. Stephen might have something fucking. <laughs> he might have something yeah. in a barrel, mate. He's coming out with something. I can see it. It's gonna it's be crazy. <laughs> I know what it's gonna be. Let's join the Klu Klux Klan. Yeah, Jesus. Well, I, why have you said yes? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I said do you to him. Oh, I thought you said yeah. Of, I, can't I know what story you're going to tell. It's going to come into your mind. What's happened to you interesting this week? Oh, yeah, they're going to... The yeah, I'm not talking about that thing, but I wonder what he's talking about. That, probably. What? Yeah. Do you know? I don't know. No, he doesn't. Oh. <laughs> so I'm wondering what story he's on about. Go, 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 go yeah, story. tell okay. your story, Chris. I'll Fuck me. All right, if Get you... on with it. <laughs> <laughs> Taking the piss. Am I going to say without getting interrupted? No, okay. probably not. <laughs> Go on. Right, okay. So I w- I'll just... I'm going to say it dead quick. Uh, so I work with someone. <laughs> They've got a dog, recently got a dog. And he's, he's like a little Labrador thing. Um, anyway, she uh, obviously takes it for walks and that. Anyway, this this person at work, she's got a thing with, like, she gags at, like, anything remotely sort of a bit gross. Oh, mm-hmm. really? <laughs> Fucking always... No. Oh, no. <laughs> where, are <you> go- <laughs> where are you going with that, mate? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm shot. always making a gag. Oh, you're sick. <laughs> you are sick. Literally work with this woman. It is a woman, isn't it? <laughs> Fuck's sake. Yeah. I was going to say that, but I stopped myself. <laughs> you're uh, fucking weird. Yeah. No, okay. So she's got a dog. And then... Uh, she she uh, went with her sister to take it uh, for a walk. Anyway, the dog, just a fucking, like, dirty as shit. Anyway, she goes to pick it up. As she's picking it up, she throws up everywhere. <laughs> she throws up, and it's dead windy. It's, like, all down, all in her hair. She's, like, a state. And then she's like, oh, fuck. We'll just keep going with the walk, whatever. And then uh, walks a little bit, little bit further up the hill. The dog's sh- uh, shits again. <laughs> She goes to pick it up again, immediately sick everywhere. <laughs> and it's just like an absolute mess. The dog's been like walking in it and stuff. It's just a state. And then she's like, we're here now. I may as well just finish it. We'll just may as well keep going. Uh, and then in the meantime, because like the mess that's going on, she's like past her sister in a poo bag. She's like, hey, hold this. I was like, like, clean myself up. Anyway, they're walking further up the hill. And she looks at her sister and she's like, what, like, what is on your coat there? Anyway, all the shit had gone <laughs> all over her sister's coat, yeah. Ow. <laughs> and then she sees that, throws up again. Oh, for God's Three sake. times. Three times. Anyway, and then she says, because she was laughing so much, she pissed herself, and it was just like... <laughs> <laughs> you didn't tell us that. Yeah. Maybe she shouldn't yeah. own a dog. Mm, you'd think, yeah. wouldn't you, she'd have re- like maybe realised, I'm not great at, at dealing with shit. <laughs> but then apparently she's, she's like gone back to her mum to like drop her sister off, and they've gone... What the fuck has happened? <laughs> like she's covered in sick and sister's covered in shit. Yeah. That is horrendous. Mm. Are you gonna name and shame them? No. She knows. <laughs> That's she, what I she knows. She knows what she's done. <laughs> so yeah. So I thought that was quite a funny story. Or maybe I shouldn't have shared it. That is a good story. No, that is a good story. Yeah, and you've won. Yeah, I was gonna yeah. say I don't think anything's gonna beat you. <laughs> well let's hear yours, Stephen. What was the story you were thinking of? I was I thought you were gonna start talking about the caravan, yeah. Oh. How they just ditched it on you. <laughs> um, I could, uh, to be fair, I could talk about that. Um, yeah, we got, because we were getting a caravan and it got dropped off because we, ha- we were supposed to have it like a couple of weeks ago. Again, the weather has just been awful. But like a couple of weeks ago, it wasn't. And then th- this week, like last week, it was just horrendous rain. And then they dropped it off the day after the rain in a field. So it was just like by the entrance where there was stone, so it was fine. But we needed to get it to a pitch. And we just tried and it just got stuck in the middle <laughs> of the field. It just went wrong, just, didn't it? Yeah, it was just all horrible, m- wet mud, and it just got stuck in the middle of the field, and it just sat there, and it's still there, you know, <laughs> because it's been raining every day since, pretty much. He texted me halfway through it, and he was like, so we were moving the caravan, because we attached a tow bar, because they delivered it without a tow bar, didn't they? So didn't you couldn't even move it. or legs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but what were we supposed to do? <clears throat> they managed to get a tow bar on it, started moving it, and then, did you say your dad was pulling it, and then you were pulling your dad? Yeah. Yeah. And then his dad said... Keep going, go faster. I was in, I was in the car front. Yeah, towing his jeep. And then the his mum thought he said, 
slow down. <laughs> so Stephen so stopped. Stop. stop, stop, stop. And I stopped, and my dad was fuming. So he's like, <laughs> now he, him, the Jeep, and the caravan all got stuck in the middle of the field. Yeah. And mum told me to stop. And his dad's still there in the field. <laughs> <laughs> Shaking. Right. Nice. Chris wins. Oh, not Chris won. Yeah. No, well, well he hasn't won. Oh, <laughs> no, yeah. It's his mate from work that he he's, gar- makes gags. He's just claiming victory. I'll take it. You do that quite a lot, to be mm. fair. Cheats. Yeah. You're a cheater. The, the, you said that we, it could be a story that, like, you've heard. Of you, no, it isn't that you've heard. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it specifically of, says yeah. right here something that's happened to them. Yeah. Recently or in the past. Well, someone told me. <laughs> <laughs> so the story is, you got told a story. Yeah. Out of a story, <laughs> you still win. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> out of all of them, that was the best. <laughs> if you want to become a Milkmen founder, check out milkmen.shop with limited hoodies, t shirts, caps, and more. Milkmen Original will keep you cuddly, warm, and cozy. Mm. It's nice. With free shipping on orders over £69 across the UK, purchase any product and you will be labeled as a Milkmen founder. Make sure to check out the merch at milkmen.shop. And there's new hoodies, t-shirts, and hats, and all that type of shit with a new design, that which only, only I'm wearing. wearing. <laughs> Even though we all have the new merch. <laughs> Mine's just over there. So, yeah, so is mine. Yeah. <laughs> so is mine. <laughs> Fuck's sake. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is actually good. Well, it's it, is, it does look good. It's better quality than the previous ones as well. Like, it's even better. It is even better. They're, they're like, so soft. Yeah. It's weird. All right. Like my bum. What? Carry on. Time for the weekly news recap. Yep. Does anybody have anything they want to talk about? I mean, is what's going to get talked about on there yeah. before I mention? Like, well, a lot of fight stuff. Yeah. Okay. Well, yeah. I was going to... Yeah. Okay. The Misfits boxing event. It was very good, the event itself. The fights weren't very good. What fight are we uh, talking about, Sai? Well, let's talk about KSI versus Tommy Fury. Absolute shit. Terrible. The main fight. Yeah. And it was <laughs> awful. <laughs> Did you actually watch it live? Uh, no, not live. No, but watching Prey. Yeah, we were watching Prey, which is way better. Oh, you just watched like the, like, the uh, highlights? Yeah. Which ones? Because there wasn't any. It was all shit. I just watched it on like Twitter and shit. Did yeah. you did you watch it? I just I, I followed the live updates and it was all like, oh KSI's got this in the bag basically. And then it goes, Tommy Fury wins. I was like, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> and then I watched the highlights and they just spent the whole time hugging. So yeah. I was like, oh okay. Cool. Like no Tommy Fury won, but no one won. Because yeah. it yeah. was an awful show from both of them. KSI was just doing fucking star jumps the whole time. <laughs> and Tommy's this, like, professional boxer that's been boxing since he was six. And he was shit. Yeah. Like, he, he blames it on, like, oh, well, when, you know, when you're in the gym and you're actually boxing, like, you know, you actually want to fight. But he was... If you watch what he was doing as well, he they're was both, going in for a yeah, hug. Yeah, they're both doing hugs, like, weren't they? They were both mate. as bad as each other. Yeah. And it's the, the thing is, he's, like, going, like, oh, yeah, fucking, I've won both. He's only just done it by the skin of his teeth against yeah. YouTubers. Yeah. And he won by one yeah. point. Yeah. Against a YouTuber that had only started, like, what, a few years ago? Yeah. Like, fuck off. <laughs> Why are you bragging about this, dickhead? <laughs> but I, I couldn't take him, so well done, Tom. <laughs> yeah. I could. Nice. Yeah, you could. All fucking right. take it up the arse. With <laughs> what about Logan and Dylan? That was better, but again, it's like, Dylan, what are you fucking doing? <laughs> <laughs> Dildo fucking like that the whole time, didn't throw a punch. Then starts tell, hitting the security. I could tell Stephen was like the happiest man when <laughs> just just seeing what was happening, and then when Logan won as well. I yeah. just know for a fact he was loving his life. But there's a bit was. there's a bit of controversy, isn't there? Because Logan's security guard jumped in mm, in the is it times. the sixth round? Yeah. He jumped in early, so mm. Logan might now get like disqualified after the fact. Dylan lost, so yeah, he lost, but I didn't get who won. Just Dylan, had Dylan to lose. lost. <laughs> yeah, but. He might not. He's already disqualified. Yeah, but that happened after Logan's security guard came in. But then they're Do both going to be disqualified. Yeah, so they both it's be a pointless yeah. fight. Yeah. yeah, I mean, but Dylan yeah. lost. Well, that makes everyone happy. <laughs> Did you see the ending though? Did you see it, Ella? 
I haven't watched any of it. Who's Dylan, though? I've never heard of oh, him. Oh, he's just, just, don't, don't just an absolute cunt. He's so weird. He's obsessed with Logan's fiance. Yeah. He's like, a strange, he's strange man. And he gives, like... They've even done a lawsuit against him. Like, they? Like, like, oh, yeah, they did. Like really? Yeah. Yeah. Found it, they found it ages ago while he was doing it because he just kept posting pictures of her every single day for, like, five months. He posted a picture of her, photoshopped and everything. Like, they were, like, photoshopped weird, That's like, odd. her in, like, really weird positions yeah. and stuff like that. And oh, even with, like, really even with him... Even though he's got his his, his wife's just give birth to a kid, yeah, he, and it's just like not his kid. He's him. he's a strange strange he man, no, it's really. Weird. And then he's still talking like yeah. smack after the fight, like yeah. oh you'd kill me, uh, I'd kill you in a fight. It's like, didn't <laughs> you <laughs> fucking didn't, yeah. and you couldn't. Clearly not. Yeah. But it was so obvious when they both came out because it was like Logan looked like an absolute fucking beefcake. Like I, I had a bit of a semi, I'm not gonna lie. And was then that? Dylan came out, and he just looked like, like where's the fight? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, what's this about? But there was actually photos of him out drinking the night before, before. in Manchester. Yeah, he so he just wasn't taking it seriously <laughs> whatsoever. Logan yeah. looked massive, though, to be fair. Yeah. Like, oh. what? What? He looked hung. He, no, honestly, like... Hang on. <laughs> he looked like, he, he had, like he, his arms looked like he had gorilla arms, mate. It was weird. Mm. Like, he was huge. Do you reckon he's on anything? Yeah? Are you yeah. joking? <laughs> what are you... Fu- do, you reckon, do you reckon he might be on steroids? Like, <laughs> fuck off. <laughs> yes, he is. Yeah, but they're boxing, so they're not... So, yeah. What? They, don't they get tested for boxing, then? Drug w- tests. Do you know, you know how steroids work? You don't... You're not constantly on steroids. You do a few weeks, and then you're off. Yeah, but surely it's still in your system. Well, he would have done it so that he's not... It's not in his system, but he's still got the, you know, built, hasn't he? You know what I mean? Not that I know anything about <laughs> steroids. Not, not that you've researched it. No, not that I've... No, no, no. <laughs> All right, fair enough. And the other interesting fight, Salt Puppy versus Slim. Best one of the night. Never heard of them. Didn't watch it. Oh, what? Mate, that was literally the best fight of the night because everyone expected Salt to win. Yeah. Because he's a good fighter and he's like won however many he's yeah, done but, so, but Slim's a very good fighter as well. He is. But it's, it's strange because uh, it looks like there's nothing off Slim. Do you know what I mean? But yeah, it's well, he'll, he'll Slim. put people down. <laughs> yeah, and it was a really good fight because like Salt was just going around, basically just smiling, like he was having a nice time. And then Slim got a few good hooks, and then Salt's just like, "Hang on a minute, yeah. what's fucking happening there?" <laughs> then all of a sudden, Salt's just on the floor. Yeah, <laughs> it was a really good fight. If you if you're gonna watch any of them, watch that one. I was expecting Salt to win, to be honest, because. He's been putting in work. Yeah. Like, a lot but of work. I th- people are saying that's probably the reason he lost, because he lost so much weight so quickly. Lost most of his power. Yeah. Mm. But I put a bet on, only for a fiver, for Logan to win against Dylan and KSI to win against Tommy. What were the odds? 33 to 1. So, with it being one point away from KSI winning, and I could have won 170 quid from a fiver bet, I was... Fucking fuming that he didn't. <laughs> I was I was shouting all sorts of stuff at the TV like. So, anyway, moving on. <laughs> before do I you, repeat um, any of it, do you want to talk about this uh, Captain Tom thing? Because I have no idea what it's about. Read it. Captain Tom's daughter says the family kept eight hundred thousand pounds from his books. Following Hannah Ingram Moore's explosive interview with Piers Morgan, it has been confirmed that Captain Tom Foundation will close down. After an investigation into it concludes, Sir Captain Tom Moore became a national fundraising hero when he raised more than £39 million for NHS charities before his 100th birthday. That's the... Um, Veteran. Yeah. yeah, the guy I, I, yeah, like, I know Captain who he is. But I was like, is that a pirate? <laughs> I was, Captain. I, <laughs> obviously, I know of him. I don't I don't know about so what's happened. Or wasn't it? So, obviously, they set up a charity. And then, In his name. Yeah. And, and then, then his daughter was, was the CEO. Money, oh. Yeah, she was, like, taking a cut. Yeah, Something she was right. the C- she she became the CEO and took eighty grand a year. I think it was eighty grand. Might have been even more. It might, I think it was actually. Yeah. It might have been more, but like a ridiculous amount for a CEO, considering she didn't it, like if it weren't for him, she'd have had nothing. Mm. Yeah. And then there was that whole thing about her building a spa yeah, at I her saw home. That on the back of a house or something. Yeah, yeah. I think it was like one point three million that they took for that spa, not needed, nothing to do with the charity. Like access to milk. <laughs> Love milk. Not the shop spa. <laughs> yeah, Wait. Got <laughs> <laughs> yeah. employees in it and everything. <laughs> and then, uh, yeah, she's just been found out to take taking 800k from her dead dad. What a scumbag. Yikes. Like, what the fuck? Imagine 
Imagine. Like you just Was he just holding on to it in the grave? <laughs> She's taking bits out every now and again. <laughs> a bit inappropriate, mate. Yeah, he's dead. Yeah. <laughs> Captain Tom. Hmm? Everyone dies. That is true. Everyone does die. I've done it twice. <laughs> <laughs> you literally have. <laughs> but what about like you know like other charities? Like surely them CEOs take a cut. Yeah, they do. So like why aren't they getting Pass all about it. Well, because well, I mean, I was, she was obvious she, about it. No, well, I think she was doing it illegally. Right. So she wasn't doing it like. Well, I mean, she built a fucking spa <laughs> out of the money from a charity. Yeah. Mm. Again, not what a shot. A scumbag. Yeah. No, I think it's something like, isn't it, twenty p of every pound? No, wait, hang on. Every pound that you donate to a charity, only twenty p of it actually goes to what the charity does. Yeah. For the charity for. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, it's only a small percentage. Yeah, that's why that's I don't I mean. donate to charity. Fuck I me. don't because I don't care. Um. <laughs> 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 no, why don't you donate to charity, Ellis? I do. We're not going right. around the table Weird. And, and asking why we don't donate to charity. <laughs> what charities do you do? <laughs> what charities do you know, donate to? Uh, RL and I. Um. The Ellis charity. <laughs> 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 what? Straight into my pocket. Yeah. <laughs> He's um, building a spa at the back of his house. <laughs> <laughs> but an actual shop. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Just the RNLI? From the top of my Just head. Just the, the one. Wow, brilliant. Yeah. What a scumbag. I know. <laughs> <laughs> what about, like... Oh, man. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> what I about... didn't know we were a charity. <laughs> well, we donate to charity if you go to milkman.shop. Uh, Segway. What, what, uh, what about you, Chris? What, donating to charity? Yeah, do you or don't you? Are you a shit house or are you? Um, hmm, I've I mean, donated if you've... before, <laughs> currently. If you've got to think about it. Mate, it was just farted. I can smell it. Well, it's not me. I can't smell it. Only you can smell it. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. I swear it wasn't me. Only you can smell it. Oh, um... Sure, it's like your breath reflecting off the mic. <sighs> Oh, I don't know. Oh, mate, you know, like in films when something pauses, like time, and then someone just farts in your face and then just <laughs> unpauses time. It's literally, it's literally like that's just happened. It's just the salt is your nostrils. Yeah. Sorry. Anyway, carry on. Uh, if you haven't already, make sure to follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. Handle is at Watch Milkmen. You get behind. Didn't hear me. Try again. You get behind the scenes and extra content, and also because. Please do it for me, Daddy. Once again, at Watch Milkmen across all social media. Thank you very much. <laughs> right. <laughs> Curdle Conversation. A conversation between the six of us where we delve into the hypotheticals of the world's most notorious and despicable questions that we now encourage you, the audience, to send us. Got a question? Send it in. Comment below. The question now is, what are some God-tier superpowers? God. That's not a superpower, that's a man. Oh, right. I've actually got one. Go on. This this would be my power if any question was like, what superpower do I have? It'd be this. The ability to manipulate probability. Do you know what? You've said that before. We've, yes. we, we've had this, this question. Yeah, 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 it's the best. Saying, we've had this question already, that's what I'm confused. I feel like we've done it, yeah. Right, round two, carry on. What, another question? <laughs> no, no, the same question. Oh, we'll answer right. it again, but with different answers. <laughs> oh, well, there is no other God tier superpower. So, uh, the ability to pause time before the alarm s starts in the morning at work, so you can sleep for longer. Nice. Yeah. That's it. You're an wow. idiot. Why is he an idiot? Because he just is. <laughs> no, he must have paused time so he can fart in people's faces. Yeah. <laughs> That's what he's doing. I wouldn't <laughs> fart in my own face, would I? <laughs> oh God, hang on, hang on, lads. Pause time. <laughs> fart in my own face and then unpause time. <laughs> Who's just farted? Why would I do that? <laughs> he you just does do. it. He goes, got him. <laughs> yeah, mm. That's like something you do. It does. Mm. So, okay, so it's a pause time. What did I say last time? Uh, so I think it's something different. Flying's <laughs> boring, isn't it? Yeah, that's what I said last time. Yeah, because oh, I yeah. wanted a real. Yeah, flying's fucking boring. Anyone that comes up with <laughs> <laughs> the answer flying is a boring fucker. No, I mean that's meant, what you've just no, said. I mean it's a good one, but it's the one oh. that everyone. Goes oh, it's a good one now, is it? Right. 
<laughs> no, that's, I'm sorry, forgive me. I'm not offended. Oh no, he is. He is. He's already He's down. He's fuming. Wait, yeah. Alice, Alice, what was your answer? Flight. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you have to confirm it, Stephen? Well, no, because he, no, he said that was last time. I wondered, I didn't know if he answered this time. Yeah, new answer. Right. Yeah, it's got to be. So, oh, I, hang on. I haven't thought of something different. All right. Well, Why fucking hell. Why Simon's has it got to be you? Because you asked me. Didn't you? No. <laughs> All right. Then. Fine, I'll sit here quietly. That's fucking hell. Wait you your did. turn, That's mate. That's you did. Uh, <laughs> Ellis? Uh, phase view objects. That is a good one. Oh, that would be a good one, yeah. That is a good one. Do some sick shit with that. <laughs> 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 like what? You phase it and phase me. <laughs> what? You know what I'm thinking. I'd phase through walls and fart in people's rooms. <laughs> <laughs> just your just arse. Just your arse. <laughs> 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 Imagine sitting there, you just see an arse come through the wall and fart. <laughs> Follow through a little bit. No, that's a good for <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. That's pretty fucked up. All right, Chris, <laughs> how's your dude? Uh, hmm. Oh, fuck. I can't think of something. Well, but like teleporting, but again, that's fairly like. I think you said that last time. Did I? No, I feel like I said something fucked last time, Mike. Didn't you say something about 9 11? No, oh, I right, know. Yeah. Like. 9-11. What? Hang on. <laughs> <laughs> That's, just That's just super bad. You can just fly planes. That is bad. <laughs> <laughs> we don't want this fucker flying a plane. <laughs> um, I, what about... Oh, I don't know. I was thinking, like... Oh, how can you beat, like, probability, like... Luck, like, luck you, in it, you like, don't being like, lucky. Yeah. Dominoes. Yeah. Yeah. Dominoes, yeah. Dominoes, yeah. yeah. Mm. Uh... I mean, Deadpool's pretty cool. So his power, get cancer. <laughs> <laughs> and always be on the brink of dying. Yeah. That's just me. <laughs> no, I've got cancer. Okay, yeah. I was going <laughs> to... Oh, this is going to be a deep segment for a minute. Fucking <laughs> okay, hell. Yet. Yeah, yeah. It's probably going to happen. Well, it's one in two, isn't it? Mm. So chances are... I don't know what that means. One in two... Mate, come on. I don't know what and one in two You're talking about means. probability. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you'll, have the, you'll have the ability to change it. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, but he doesn't have the superpower. It the this is this is reality now. One in two people are going to get it, so chances are some of us are going to have it. I've literally got superpowers now. You can't tell me otherwise. <laughs> he's, Steven. Got, he's got mental health problems. <laughs> you haven't got speed. <laughs> haven't got good reactions. Just you know. But I mean, the Flash. I'd say speedster. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You said phase in a object, kid's park. The flash, the flash can do that. Yeah, plus, kind of go back in time. Plus, be fast. Yeah, that is a good one. Shame the TV show and films are shit though. Yeah. yeah. Well, the first few seasons. Yeah, are. I was gonna say the first couple of seasons. Are good. Yeah, but then it gets real bad. Yeah. All right. Next question. <laughs> what would you do if you only had twenty-four hours to live? Die. That's Kill right. myself. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I've only got 20. Yeah, but you may as well have them, do you know what I mean? Um, Go to oh. the Winchester and wait for it to all blow over. <laughs> it doesn't blow over, you just die. <laughs> you just <laughs> die in, in the pub. Exactly. Uh, Best place to die. Oh, I don't know. you just have to do something mental, wouldn't you? Terrorist attack. Mm. I, do you know what? I knew you were going to say that. You need to do something that's going like, to remember. Yeah, 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 yeah. So... Why not? You're going to die. <laughs> <laughs> Why not bring some down with me? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're sick in the head, mate. <laughs> yeah, you're fucked. You Literally make your co-workers <laughs> gag. Oh, Sorry. <laughs> just, yeah, should we just apologise? <laughs> yeah, yeah, we, we, sorry about we the should. Thing. What would you do, Steve? Yeah. Get some bitches. Just play Destiny <laughs> for the <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Continues yeah, yeah. play his grind. Games, yeah. Wait, like a normal day. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> would you? I would dunno. You have twenty four hours to live and you just ah, well just continue watching T V. I don't know. You wouldn't do anything mad? Could do maybe like travelling or something. Travelling, where would you go? Because you got twenty four hours, remember, so you got yeah, to can't get go somewhere. can't go to Australia, that's a twelve yeah, hour flight. Spa yeah. next door. Can't go well back. he could get yeah, there. He couldn't get back. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well you're not gonna get back, you're dead. <laughs> Yeah, but you, you, 
waste half your day sat on a plane. Or go there and come back. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> so that's it. Seconds land. <laughs> the whole twenty four hours just on a flight. <laughs> well, okay. Well, Chris. Nice. Um, I think I just do some. I mean, it's just a bit it's just cringing it, but I just do something that I like. It's twenty four hours, isn't it? So I would like touch kids. No, I can't do that again. Um, <laughs> so I'd, I don't know. I'd like rent like a car, a, a Ferrari, a McLaren. <laughs> yeah, but just because you have twenty four hours, doesn't mean you have a million pounds. That's why you said How rent. Much, yeah. I'm not going to buy it, am I? Have you got a mate to rent a Ferrari? Why are you renting it? Rob it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You've got no consequences. <laughs> yeah. Hang on a minute. You might be onto something Well, there. do you know what? <laughs> I'll pay someone for a car that I could rob. <laughs> well, get it back. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, they might not with this fucking driving. What do you mean? I literally have never been in an accident. Hmm. No, Let you... me do something illegal. Yeah. <laughs> You've been in two, haven't you? People have driven to me. That's not me driving. Because yeah. you're a bad yeah. driver. You literally slammed on the brake and then someone came into the back of your mate. No. <laughs> Only one time I wasn't even in the car. It was an empty car. And that's car. your fault for parking <laughs> where you were parked, mate. Sorry, yeah, for parking away from everybody, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck. Um, um, what was the question? <laughs> no, it was 24, 24 hours. 24 hours, yeah. Uh, or what about like, okay, you're going to die anyway, so try stuff that you like. Whoa, you where's this going? I'm going to say like do some drugs or something. Oh. I mean, you can, it's illegal, but Dies you, from you drugs. die. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just to see what it's like. Have your first pint. No, that's too much, though. Would you not? You still wouldn't try alcohol. <laughs> I probably would then. I'm going to die in 24 Mate, hours. Mate, right. Now I'm going to do. Yeah. Next time <laughs> we go Video out, idea. I'm just going to say to him, I'm going to fucking kill you tomorrow. <laughs> and then he'll drink. No. That would work. <laughs> I'll give you, you a pill that him. kills you in 24 hours. Where are you getting this yeah, pill from? Like? Never you mind, <laughs> mate. It's just a paracetamol, but it's still bad. Placebo. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> makes you better. <laughs> Al? Mm, just drink myself stupid, I guess. Fair? Mm. Sorry? I would... do a podcast. <laughs> no, you wouldn't. Lads, you I've barely got make to this tell one. You. <laughs> 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 Hang on a minute. No, what I'd actually do is probably steal like a seven four seven. Back to the planes. Uh oh. And I'd I'd see if it's possible to do like barrel rolls and shit in it. Oh okay. So, so, can so you, he's yeah, dying can before twenty. Can you fly a seven four seven? I'll learn. How hard can it be? <laughs> Just put the key in and. <laughs> in the ignition. <laughs> got twenty four hours. Put it on autopilot, you dick. <laughs> you just kidnapping a pilot. Well, it's not going to do barrel rolls, oh, is yeah. it? I could kidnap a pilot. Take it with me. This is not a good plan. No, but I'll enjoy it. So the, you're killing a pilot? Yeah, but... A bad pilot? Yeah, one that did Work, a bad thing. Works at Ryanair? Yeah. Or like... I'll just kill anyone, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> I just don't care, yeah. <laughs> you just go around killing people. <laughs> do, you not, do you not want to know how it feels? To, no, I'm not going to carry on with that. What? Just to kill a person. <laughs> <laughs> Am I curious what it would feel like to kill a person? Yeah. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, see? It's something, it's in there, like, in everybody's mind, mate. Not don't really. lie to me. I've already killed people. What? I don't feel anything. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> He's numb to it now. Uh, I wonder what it would be like Should to I actually. Should I find out? No, do you know what Just I mean? Take another man's I mean, you're life. the only one to not. What? <laughs> 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 no, because they say there's that thing in you, isn't there? Like if someone, was, if you're in that situation where you're gonna die. Mm. Yeah, it's like it's fight like, or flight. But yeah, I found out that mine is fight. <laughs> <laughs> until, Just, it, until you die <laughs> at <Yeah>. all times <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you're ready to kill someone in, at like a primal level if I'm in danger I'll fight because I like battered <laughs> like eight doctors fly. in the hospital <laughs> <laughs> are they now in coma <laughs> yeah I didn't know what I was doing to be fair but I don't even remember it but like I was told that it took so many doctors to hold me down and I was like throwing <laughs> them about in the hospital wow really yeah and I was like pulling you know like the cannulas they put in and I was pulling them out and pulling the breathing tube out and everything just fighting them yeah because you, you have a scar yeah. here don't you because you 
fucking dick. You pulled it out. <laughs> it's like... And they just do the walk of shame out at the hospital and all of them are bruised and bloodied and <laughs> something out like of fight On the club. floor, like, twisted up. Mm-hmm. You've got... I think... I don't think you are just fight, though, because you have different, like, stages, I think, of, like, being angry. Because you remember when we went out and then someone was just being a dick to you at the bar and then you said like if it were me that's being a dick to you and you said this to me i'd have just started laughing because it, it's just a funny thing to say to someone but this guy's having a go at you and then you just go if you carry on i'll eat your fucking eyelids <laughs> <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't mean to say that but did he stop did he yeah stop? he yeah, did he stop, did yeah. stop he offered to buy me a drink actually as well. <laughs> <laughs> see that's funny though <laughs> <laughs> Uh, that is pretty twisted though who thinks of that weird kind of <laughs> <laughs> it's time now for the change game okay you explain it Oshan I haven't got no <laughs> got you, you've got the fucking thing <laughs> I can't see two of the milkmen perform a scene based on suggestions from everyone else at any point during the scene the host can say change at which point a previous line of dialogue and or action is replaced with a new line of dialogue and or action I think you should be one of the people that's participating because you haven't been here. Yeah, but I did it last time I was here. Yeah, like six months ago. <laughs> Didn't I do the last one? I swear I was that doctor. You were the one. host, weren't you? No, it was me and Oshan, I think, for the last one. Okay, so you host. Yeah. And it'll be Alice and Simon. <laughs> um, you sure you don't want to host? <laughs> Didn't I host the last one, though? Yeah, you did. Yeah, All right, I'll host then. I'll say change. <clears throat> oh, oh, we've got to think of this. Got to think of what, who they are, what they are, what they're doing. An actual story. <sighs> yeah, not the whatever happened with the doctor and the, you know, the schizophrenic. It was a funny one, though. That, that was funny. <laughs> you were in, yeah, you were in it for that. Was it, <laughs> did, it go, like, did it go into come again? No, no, no. No, it was like, surprisingly. Oh, no, fair enough. It went to like a psychotic yeah, episode we were, for an episode Danny. of Inception. Yeah, me and Danny, and then next you know, I never existed. It what? was just Danny. <laughs> so he was schizophrenic. But then Chris was part of the story. But then Danny never existed. It was Chris. He just went through the table. And then Ellis joined in as the doctor, the who wasn't ended. He ended up as not being a doctor or something. Yeah. So it was good. So I'm not here, Sam. We have a good time when you're not here. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck the lot of you. <laughs> what What are they? Who are they? Uh, that's Simon. I will beat your shit up. <laughs> Go on, so hang on. What does that mean? <laughs> Sorry, I'll it. grab it out of his arse. <laughs> what if he's Alice and I'm Simon? Whoa. Ooh. <laughs> Hang on, this could go really Probably. wrong. Yeah. Horribly, but you could offend it. both of each other. You're Alice, you're Simon. <laughs> <laughs> and you've got to offend the fuck out of each other. Oh, he's just going to do fat jokes. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, he won't. I already hate this game. But he's... Offending me, and I'm Simon. No, we're not changing. What? <laughs> yeah, I'm going to call you fat, but it's me. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That doesn't work. Uh, okay, that won't work. So what you want us to do is just offend each other. <laughs> so offend you're ourselves. Simon. No, wait. <laughs> you're Alice. <laughs> yes, I am. You're Simon. What, what's happening? Who, where are they going? They're in the car somewhere. They're going somewhere. They're trying to swap back bodies back. <laughs> Okay, so they're aware yeah. that... It's a Freaky Friday situation. <laughs> yeah. Where are they going, though? It's for science. I don't know. Where would you go if your body is opposite? <laughs> I don't fucking know. <laughs> this is a, a terrible... Yeah. It terrible is, isn't yeah. it? Cheers, okay. Chris. Let's, let's just, Shit, let's just change, change everything. Right. Okay. Change. <laughs> <laughs> we should have thought of this before we got to the No, point. this is what the podcast is about, mate. They need this, they need this dialogue. Yeah, Keep yeah, it yeah. going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. What could they be? They're Who? both neighbours. I feel like they're both naked. But <laughs> they're naked both neighbors. Okay, they're both neighbours and one of them's naked. Okay. And then <laughs> do they need another like a setup to that or are we just going to go with that? We're just going to go with that. And one of them's outside, already naked, so who's going to be the one that's naked? We don't know. We'll, we'll find, find that out. out. <laughs> okay, <Nice>. right. <laughs> okay. Ladies and gentlemen. Number, number, number. number. Sure. What? <laughs> what were you saying? <laughs> not funny. What did you say? This is not funny. Nothing. What did you say? Nothing. What, you said, ladies and gentlemen, and he went, Mambo number five. He said what? Mambo number five. Mambo number no, five. Oh, don't oh you don't know. Me. Oh, yeah. 
<laughs> You're the only one that doesn't get it. I don't get it. Oh, for oh, God's sake. What? What's Mambo number five? Right, so no, we'll get to that later. Out. Yeah, yeah, Right. Go. All right. <laughs> oh, I see. Change. Hey, Billy. Nice day for it. Hey, Adam. Oh, I can see that you're naked. Change. Well, we found out he was naked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was quick. I thought, I thought Simon was the naked one. Cut right to the chase on that one. Hi, Adam. Nice cock. <laughs> I grew up myself, I remember. Is why, that... have we, why have we got the accent? I don't know. You <laughs> started it. Is that uh, flaccid or placid? Uh, well, I got a little bit of a semi. <laughs> Is... <laughs> why is he... Semi. <laughs> is that because you were looking at me, or is it because of your previous activity? Oh, no, I just got done having sex with the wife. Change. The dog. Change. The cat and the dog. <laughs> is... <laughs> How would you to that? I don't know. I just the Ain't they it's both <laughs> killing and puppy size? You're goddamn right, how I like it. How the fuck did you manage that? You're a semi, and it's about as size as a semi truck. Goddamn right. That's why I called it a semi. <laughs> I actually call it the beef bus. Change. <laughs> I actually call it the salami army. <laughs> Change. <laughs> I actually call it the log of chorizo. <laughs> it looks like a chorizo as well by the color of it. Change. Yeah, <laughs> It does look like a chorizo that I just ate because it's all chewed up. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, the dog, the dog didn't like it very much. He got pretty violent. Change. <laughs> he actually loved it so much that he tried to taste it with his teeth. <laughs> <sighs> and what the results like? Oh, you can see it yourself. It's pretty messed up. <laughs> Is it still working? <laughs> no. Change. Yes. Change. Hardly. Do you, uh, do you need me to call somebody, Adam? I need you to call an ambulance, please, sir, yes. I'm sorry, sir, I cannot do that. Change. I'll call them right away. And Change. I, uh, I'll call the pet cemetery, ask them about picking up a dead killer and a puppy. Yeah, they are dead. Change. I'm losing blood, help me. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm sure the pet cemetery will fix that up as well. I'm not gonna, that I'm going to pass out, Bill. I, I'm not going to make it. <laughs> uh, I'm sure they got stitches and shit. You'll be fine, Adam. Ain't no stitches can fix this, Bill. <laughs> they need duct tape on it. Change. <laughs> they need bandages. Change. They need something. I just need... Help me, Bill. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to creep back inside now because you're starting to terrify me. All right. I'm losing consciousness anyway. <laughs> All right. Best of luck in there, Adam. Right, Take thank, care. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> what was with the accent? I don't know. <laughs> you, you fucked that for yourself. I saw it as like um like straight away I imagine like the white picket fence and <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's 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 yeah, I had that. <laughs> yeah. oh. One day we're actually gonna you know like Smosh do skits, mm. all these fucking change games things, we're gonna have to make them in real life. <laughs> not that one. I'm not fucking a dog. <laughs> <laughs> no, I said you want to fuck the dog. You have to, right. to be naked on the garden. Yeah. Yeah. The one. I'm alright with that. <laughs> <laughs> the mutilated. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, we'll, do, we'll do what we can. We'll do CGI. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bollocks. I haven't got a milk fact, so I'm going to make something up. No, this is completely true. Oh, okay. Um, milk was the reason Jesus woke up. <laughs> <laughs> Was he thirsty? To be fair, we don't know if that's yeah. fact or not. You know what I'm saying? There could have been a cow in that cave. He wanted that Mary's milk. That's too far. That's his mother. <laughs> and? <laughs> we don't know what was going on inside his head. He might want to fuck. That is a true point. Yeah. He could have had that. What's that thing? An Oedipus complex. Ooh. What yeah. the fuck? What's that? That's yeah. where you want to fuck your mum. Yeah. Mm. Mm. It's an actual thing. Really? Yeah, an Oedipus complex. It's weird, mate. Yeah. What's the word when you want to fuck one of your mate's mums? <laughs> yeah, that's just sexual attraction to your mate's mum. <laughs> <laughs> that's a MILF complex you got. <laughs> <laughs> Not that I have it or anything. Hmm? <laughs> Carry on. Okay. Well, it's just the end, isn't it? Bye. Thanks for listening to the podcast, everybody. Please consider subscribing to our Patreon. Patreon.com slash milkmen for early access to our videos, bonus content. 
monthly tow pictures, merchandise, discounts, signed postcards, your name in the videos we produce, and more. And also, make sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel, because we want you to. And make sure you click that bell for notifications. See you next time, and I apologise for missing so many podcast episodes, because I'm a shit house cunt bag with really nice friends who tolerate my bullshit. Bye!